Harbor Springs Municipal Airport. Automated weather observation. One, two, five, five. Zulu weather. Wind. Calm. Visibility. One, zero. Clear. Below. One, two, thousand. Temperature. One, three. Celsius. Dew point. One, two. Altimeter. Three, zero, three, two. Harbor Springs traffic. Skyline Azo. I'm taking off to a Harbor Springs. are green. Your speed's a lot. It's, it's the intercom thing. Rotate. I don't know if it's hot miking though. It's just, I don't think it's a hot mic. Hey, you should talk through the mic and see if uh, the kids just... Buddy, can you hear you? Like, say something. Mike, can you hear me? I want to turn a little heat on, baby. Okay. Harbor Springs traffic. Still ain't eight zero. Pump that goes to parting area to the southwest. Harbor Springs. Yep. Harbor Springs traffic. Water two two one Delta Echo parting runway two eight straight out. Harbor Springs. Yeah, we'll be out your way when you get up here. And if you guys want to check your mic, it sounds like you got a stuck mic. Uh, no, we're hearing it too. I don't think it's on our end. Gotcha. Oh my gosh, it's gorgeous down yeah, here. Yeah, look at there. Oh, what a beautiful morning. Carlo yeah. Road, 122A. Yeah. Oh, that's the same one. That's who we're here. See, there's all these islands out here too, so it's you're not really that far from land. Oh, this is a wide, wide sandy area. Right there. There's some houses, but they um, they don't have any grass around them. It's all sand. Oh, really? Yeah. Just these islands look like uninhabited. They don't have anything on them. That yeah, doesn't look like it, does it? I'm sure boaters enjoy it. I was thinking the same thing. There are some buildings on this island, but just a handful, and it's a big island. Now, this island has quite a few boats in a little cove anchored. This one has a lighthouse. I see all the boats in the bay now. Yeah, and there's a long little skinny lake in the middle of it, too. Okay, I do think it would be so much fun to, to sail all through here. I, you know, we kind of poo-pooed that when we were looking into sailing classes and courses, but I kind of think now I'd like to come up here. I know. It wouldn't be that expensive to... That's just it. Is it, The charter costs about the same, but it would be so much less expensive to get to it. Look at the, the sand cliffs over here, Ron. Uh-huh. Oh, that may be what she was talking about. Uh, weird having these build-ups out here in the open water, because typically that happened. It's mostly over land. Yeah. Boy, that's a pretty nasty looking cloud. I know it. It's actually not that high. Land up there? Yep, I think so. Over the water. In fact, you can see the land from both sides. Both sides. Yeah. We have had an excellent trip. Yeah, we've had a great time. Eaten and done lots of stuff. Ate some really good food and ate some interesting food. Well, the interesting food was the interesting food part. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> we went to a, a Polish restaurant, been there for over a hundred years, I think. Very authentic. Yeah, that, that, that's definitely true. If you're in the mood for some authentic Polish cuisine, then Legs Inn in Cross Village, Michigan is your place to go. The drive along the coast was just awesome as there were deer everywhere. Oh, hey there. You're a beautiful girl. Yeah. What are you doing out this time of day? Your friends back there in the woods? 
Okay, well, I think we're gonna go. Hello, dear. Your friend crossed the street. And this little guy ran out in front of us, stood up on his hind legs, and started hissing at us like he wouldn't let us by. fish we ate though was off a food truck. Food truck, yeah. I mean that was excellent. Yeah. Uh, I had a grouper and it was really, really good. Uh, I had some white fish and I yeah, and it was really good. Wow, it's it's totally different look on this side. It really is. It's a lot more flat. Yeah. Farmland looking. Yeah, definitely. There are two rivers coming out. They kind of joined to go into the lake right here. For what we, boy, that uh, marina has a nice protected area. Look at that. That is. Oh, that's man-made. Oh yeah. If that's another river. They have. That's a third river right in this area. Here, right on top of Sheboygan, Ron. There it is. Oshkosh. Oh, yeah. You want to go buzz the airport just for grins <laughs> and giggles? So Ron, we had never had any idea of what northern Michigan is like. I mean, it had no clue. I mean, I've heard a lot of people talk about it, but... I don't know if I just filtered it out and I know. didn't pay any attention to them or what. It was it was absolutely gorgeous. It, it's very pretty. We're gonna miss the rain. Remember, I said there was some rain yeah. down that way. It's it's already gone. Look at the front ways again. The one eight or one three. One three is right down the way, huh? Traffic, I see him. Two of them. Two miles. Nine hundred feet Here. below. Two of them. Traffic. Twelve oh, o'clock. I see. I see. Oh yeah, they're in uh, eight hundred uh, feet below. Oh, oh, there they are. Oh, I 
you. I am starting to get hungry now. I'm very hungry. Washington Municipal Airport. Automated weather observation. One, five, three, seven, Zulu. Wind, zero, niner, zero, at five, nine. Visibility, more than one, zero. Sky condition, clear, below one, two, thousand. Temperature, two, zero, Celsius. Dew point, one, five, Celsius. Altimeter, three, zero, two, niner, inches of mercury. Washington Municipal, Skyline 80, Papa Echo is eight to the west, inbound on runway one, three, full stop, Washington. Munich Skyline Angel Pop that goes five to the west, then bound to one three equals stop. Two mile final runway one three. Washington Munich Skyline Angel Pop that goes short final one three full stop, Washington. There are two courtesy cars available at Washington Iowa's airport. We picked one, drove into town, just noticed some really great houses and architecture along the way. Cafe Dodici, they specialize mostly in Italian food and supposed to be very authentic from what we heard from the guys at the airport. We ate outside and as we were waiting on our food, Janice kind of struck out and filmed a little bit of the downtown area. It kind of reminds us of Mayberry RFD, just a very quaint, just nice, quiet little country little town in the middle of Iowa. And she found the theater. It's the oldest uh, theater that's been operating since 1897. And surprisingly, the front door was unlocked. So Janice being Janice, just walked right on in and filmed a little bit of the inside of it. 